episode six. Episode six. We made it. We made it. We're surviving one week at a time. Uh, thanks for watching, you guys. This is really cool still to me. Um, I'm not spectacular at math, but this means that there are only two episodes left. So, uh, so thank you again. This has been a very colorful week. There's a very wide array of activities. You are coming behind the scenes at our new commercial shoot. You are coming along to see how we say goodbye to one of our OG cast members who we're gonna miss dearly. And then, you know, how we welcome our newest member of the company. So you guys will get to see that as well. A lot of you have asked what my pre-show rituals are. So beyond warming up and we do like a cast circle at five minutes and that kind of thing. Uh, I get to show you a little bit of that and you get to feel the energy backstage, which is like a buzz. Um, also, I actually asked Gloria when I started all of this, I asked her if she had any pre-show rituals that, that I could do, um, that I could apply to my own process. And she does. So she has her arms outstretched before a concert backstage with her hands wide and takes 10 deep breaths and uh, opens herself up to whatever it is that that audience needs that night. So that's what I do. You'll see a little bit of that. And then there's girls' night after the last show of the week. There's a little girls' night action at the Mark Anthony concert at Radio City Music Hall, which was lush. And our epic day off. We had an epic day off because one of our producers sent us to a water park. And things were fun. <laughs> so let's just say we all ended up in Jersey doing a rum tasting. So you're welcome for, for sharing all of this craziness of this week. But I hope you enjoy. Hello. Hi. Anna cannot talk right now. <laughs> She's on break. That's what you call it? No, it's because it's 8 in oh, the morning. No, I mean, I can. I just I yeah, it's prefer very to be asleep. We are on our way. Tell what we're doing. I don't want to say. We are doing uh, the new shooting for the new commercial. Dramatic scenes. <laughs> yeah. I, I was wake up until 5 a.m. So it's very early. Yeah. yeah. Bueno. Not bueno. No bueno. <laughs> That's why we have <laughs> sunglasses. <laughs> you tell Bradley what we're doing. Or, or, no. or, or if you, if, do you have a passport? You're gonna need your yeah. passport. Okay. okay. So we are. All you need so we're passport, currently yeah. in the hair and makeup okay. room. So it's pretty early. What time did you wake up, Eddie? You don't have to give it to right now. You can give it. Later. I wanted to come here early. No. <laughs> okay. I love it. You're adorable. Right. Thank you. Eddie, do your commercial for Moco Sego tonight. It's empty. Moco Sego. Tata. <laughs> what does it say, Eddie? Moco Sego. What does that mean in English? Gorilla's not jail. <laughs> 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 Here is Glamazon herself, Andrea Burns. <laughs> how are you feeling this morning? Good. How do you I make it happen? Oh, yes, Starbucks. That's exactly how I make it. It's <laughs> called a character in a cup, right here. She's the best. It's not a huge deal. <laughs> not a huge deal. Lunch break on set. Just a sensible, barbecue. sensible barbecue. <laughs> and we love to eat in our wigs. It's just the most glamorous way to be. Yes. Sensible. Sensible barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so it's a pretty solemn day here. I mean, it's always going to be fun, but it's solemn because we've got Dinaidi Vasquez going, moving on from on your feet. So we're doing a little uh, cafecito toast in the green room on our way now. Uh, this is me pre-makeup, so don't judge. Let's see who's in here. Oh yeah! Oh my god. Mwah. Bella. Bon, are these, are you just I'm putting out the cafecito cups right now? I am, I'm just putting them out. Are you doing a mint? Are you giving me... This is sea foam. Sea, no, but what, if, what about, what about the food? Or mint or milk. Or, or a pistachio Asian. macaroon, perhaps. <laughs> down the block to Hamilton and she, since day one, which is almost two years ago, she has been fierce, she has been professional, she has been on her feet always and fun and just incredible to work with her. 
Hi guys, it's another day at the office. It is a Friday night, and this is what happens before the show. Everyone's kind of stretching. We just did our five-minute circle, and now we're saying hello. 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 Wow. Wow. We do each side because we're classy. Super classy. Hello. Hello. Um, very, very beautiful. Thank you. Oh, it's <laughs> Tell Broadway.com how you're feeling. She's about to make her Broadway debut. She's the newest company member of On Your Feet. How are you um, feeling? This is amazing. Super excited. This is my family since before. So now it's amazing to have it, like a real, real, more solid family. I love them all. I love We're excited to have her. We're excited to have her. So it's going to be amazing. She's going to make it happen. It's going to happen tonight. We are my favorite place in the world, aka the deli next to my apartment. The essentials and coconut water. The essentials for a Saturday night. Today is a year anniversary since I moved to New York. Had a one-way ticket um, to live my life doing what I love. So it's very exciting. We are celebrating. A lot of people have been asking what they could do to be on Broadway or to live their dreams or to do musical theater and all that stuff, so surround yourself with people who believe in you. You have to believe in yourself, and you have to do your homework. Honestly, it's the work. You work on your voice, work on your acting, work on uh, anything you possibly can. Just get out there, put yourself out there for the world to judge. It's difficult because you are the product, but um, it's so incredibly worth it. So, good luck to you all. Insane. I had never seen Mark Anthony in concert before, so I'm changed. That was insane. Yes. Broadway.com, it is Monday. We just got off this bus and we are. Hey Nina. We just got to a water park. We are having a cast water park adventure day. Here we are. Oh yeah. The camera adds 10 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> and you would think that we didn't like each other because we hang out every day and we do it on our day off too. <laughs> Where are we right now? Mountain Creek. Are you excited? Yes. Yeah. And Kevin, how old did you turn yesterday? 11. Did you have a Broadway birthday at 11? What is that Did you? I did. You did. So Kevin, of course, is one of our naive slash young Emilios in the show. And he, if you haven't seen him dance yet, I mean, you're missing out pretty much. But I want to know, Kevin, how many places have you traveled to to dance around the world just since starting on your feet he he literally has business trips what are the places you've you've traveled to for dance um it was london um it was huh? japan? Japan. japan japan la yeah i went to la oh yeah i went to turkey I went to Colombia. Yeah, we get it. We get it, okay? We get it, Kevin. You're a jet setter and you're a rock star. And you're 11 years old. <laughs> Living our dreams right now. Oh, wait. Henry, can I please? Oh, no. 
from from what the white water rap rapids. Yeah, this is really intense. And on our day off, no less. Hey guys, so we are post water park on the day off and we are in Jersey at Carlos Gonzalez's house. His grandmother has prepared a feast. So it's pretty much Thanksgiving, but not. <laughs> Exacto. Perfect. Una comida cubana en una familia tan hermosa, de Carlito y una coronita. ¿Ah? Y una coronita. Ay, ah, la coronita. Oh my God. Guayabita. Straight from Cuba. It just came from Cuba. So we just saw hand delivered to Carlos. This guayabita del Pinar. And it has a little guayabita at the bottom. And it's Ana's first time tasting. I think is it everybody else's first time as well? Yes, let's do it. Yes. The real deal. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed all of that craziness. Um, so now I'm gonna answer some of your questions. I'm gonna try to keep it short. Francesca asks, how do you make it happen being on vocal rest that much? I'd want to scream. Well, if the juice is worth the squeeze, you'll do anything for it. Um, I actually did lose my voice during this process in around uh, around April, from like April to June, I was having crazy voice problems and uh, and you realize what's worth it and what's not. Heather says, I make it happen by studying meticulously, can't be too careful when the lives of my future patients are at stake. Uh, she's studying to be a physical therapist. Yes, Heather, in fact, on Broadway, fun fact for Heather, um, we all have physical therapy. Maybe you'll come work on Broadway. Mandy Figueroa, do you suggest going to college for theater? Yeah. I mean, I suggest going to college for whatever's gonna keep you in college, <laughs> whatever's gonna get you out of bed in the morning and um, keep you focused. Vanessa Renee asks, when will you play Aaron Burr for reals? You're gonna have to wait for it. Anna, nice name says, I make it happen by waking up every morning and finding things to be grateful for, to inspire me to love and be kind always. Oh my God, you're killing it. That is it for the questions. So thank you guys so much for watching, for asking, for sharing the ways that you make it happen. I love that. It's so good to like see people actually getting into that. Guess where I'll be next week? Here. Again, we all have something to look forward to. <laughs> good night, thank you for watching. Episode six, episode seven is on the way. Get on your